Hi everyone, thank you so much for coming to my channel. My name is Lexi and we'll just get right into this video. So today I have a very crazy bundle going on. The seller was actually the same seller who was in my first video. Her name is Sugar Boutique on Depop. We had a little bit of issues uh, with the bundle and me not being descriptive, I guess. Like she said to be very specific in my bundle and I wasn't like that specific so that was definitely my fault. I also said I didn't like letters on my clothes because I don't like letters on my clothes. I did edit out a clip of me talking about why I don't like letters on my clothes. I really don't like shirts that have like cute, boy vibe, hot, sexy, all those weird words on shirts I don't like. But if it has like an actual meaning, then I like it. And I did edit it out. So that was completely my mistake. Um, I shouldn't have edited things that should have been said out. So yeah, that was that. Also, I don't like color either. I've talked about this. My whole family knows that I don't like color. My friends, you can ask anyone. I don't wear color. I'm just now starting to get into like pinks and like light pinks and creams. I did leave out a few things that I sent to her that I didn't put in the bundle, like in part of my description. Like I also said I want a Powerpuff Girl look. I wanted a Barbie look. And I wanted like a light punk goth look. She can do whatever she wants with that. Um, I shouldn't have said powder puff girl look because that's greens and pinks. I know I shouldn't have said that. And that was completely my fault. And I will own up to that because that was just my fault. Like I understand that my wording was off and yeah. But also like it doesn't excuse the fact that she gave me everything from AliExpress and it was an action less. Everything that she gave me was a total of 20 pounds and she sold it to me for 75. That is a huge profit and I definitely think that Depop needs to uh, like review their sellers before creating these bundles because a lot of them are fake. It's kind of like a half and half ratio of like good Depop bundle sellers and bad Depop bundle sellers. So, I mean, this just happens to be a bad one, but she saw the video, she said she watched it a million times, and she's really sorry, and we did have a very good conversation. She also said that she dropped somebody from her team that maybe wasn't the best fit for her company, so I respected that, and she sent me a whole new bundle. So that is where we are at today. I'm so excited to film this and do this because I want redemption for her and for me as well for also like not being completely clear on what I wanted. I just told her to like go based off my style on my Instagram and this is what she did. So we shall see how it looks. I did see a few pieces in here so I won't be so shocked. It was so nice of her to send me a new bundle. I know that she knew that she messed up with it and she knew that like, you know, it wasn't the best and the quality wasn't there and it wasn't what I paid for, basically. So, she has a note and I'm gonna read it off. I feel like I should read the note first because I mean, maybe she probably has a few things to say to you guys. So I'm gonna read it off, okay? All right, she has like her hair, her hair in it, okay. Hey Lexi, first of all, I'd like to give a huge apology from all of us here. I was shocked at the quality of your bundle and can assure you numerous changes have been made, including cutting this, this tie with our main clothing distributor, which was AliExpress. Um, we have many changes coming to our shop, including new, staff and stock i really hope you find your new bundle to be of standard i'm not going to read this part because i'm going to go into the bundle now but so at the top we have a little vogue little postcard it's really cute i love that i'm gonna hang this up thank you uh she gave me she's from uh scotland i don't know if i should say that but she's from scotland so i guess these are like little Scottish candies, Parma violets, 
Parma violets. I don't know if you can see. Okay. So let's get to the first piece. So in here we have a little bag, super cute. Little mini purse. It has a little compartment. Oh, and it has like a. It's really cute. I love this actually. So in here. We have something from Vixen. These are really nice quality. Okay, nice. Cool, so we have actually butterfly clips that are not broken and a little safety pin necklace, which is really cute. I love that little safety pin necklace that I can wear with this big safety pin that I have. So I love that. I'll definitely wear that. And then for butterfly clips. So these pants are crazy. So they still have the original tag on it. So that's really cool. The tag is super cute. Um, here is the pants. Wow. These look so cool. I love these. I love these so much. Hopefully these fit. Um, they have a little chain here. Little belt on the thighs and a little black chain as well that goes to the back of the jeans very cute i i love this she did show me this piece and i was like oh my god i love it so much like thank you but hello kitty long sleeve super cute i might crop it to make it a t-shirt because florida is kind of hot <laughs> Yeah, and then a cute little tennis skirt. I thought that she was going to send me another t-shirt because we were talking about two shirts, pant, and a skirt, but I guess not, which is fine, but yeah, this is like, I don't know if you can see, but it's a brown color. And then I will read the note, the rest of the note now. So for a run through for our clothes, I remembered in our previous DMs that you said you loved a Hello Kitty top from previous bundles. So I included the gothy grunge Hello Kitty tee. I also remembered you said you liked the shape of the skirts in our example. Um, it was an example of um, a picture that she posted on her Depop. I looked into your Depop likes and saw you have loads of trousers with chains and bondage straps. So I included my favorite ever Vixen pants, which are brand spanking new. I'm so obsessed with this label. Oh my god. Yeah, the label's so cute. I added a cute little pant chain to this for accessories and I gave you that sweet little velvet mini purse, which I love. This cute necklace it, and replacement butterfly clips. Lots of love. The new and improved Sugar Witch. So yeah. That is that. Um, I loved everything in here. In my opinion, I, I would be happy with the clothes, but I feel like it could have been a little less money for what you gave me, but I still love it and I'm still going to try it on regardless. So let's go try it on and we shall see how everything is looking. So this is the top. I like it. It's really tight on my arms, but it's, it's cute, you know. But this skirt, let <laughs> me just talk about this skirt. This skirt definitely is from AliExpress. Um, I'm sorry, you can see like my whole entire stomach. That's not cute, but um, yeah, I hate it. I won't wear it. Not, not my thing. I think it's super poorly made. And I feel so bad for saying this again, but like, look. Like, I don't know if you guys can see, but like, look at it. <laughs> like, if you can feel this fabric again, like, it's just so bad. It's not even like a skirt material. It's like, I don't know. Like, this is a no, and it hardly fits me, too. So I have to like hike it up for it to fit me. All right, guys. So here are the pants. They are super big. If I could just do this, make them so much smaller. That'd be cuter. 
and I don't know if this is how you're supposed to cup them. Maybe you're just supposed to leave them down. I'm not too sure, but I love them and I could just use a belt. So yeah, that's it. That is them. Are these supposed to be, like, these aren't supposed to be high-waisted either, I don't think. Let me know what y'all think. This is the one that she made. I don't know, dude, I don't know. Sit down. Um, so let's talk about everything. I love this top. I would wear this top. I probably would just cut the sleeves to make it a t-shirt. And these pants are amazing, but they just don't fit me correctly. If I put a belt on these pants, it would look so much better and I would like it more. So I think that's what I'm gonna do in the future. And the skirt, so poorly made, like, you know when pants or shirts or anything are so poorly made to the point where you could see like every crevice of your stomach lines and like your belly button and everything that's how you know overall i just i just genuinely don't think it's worth spending your money on this bundle on depop something was way too tight and now this is way too big so I don't know what was going on there, but yeah, that is it for me. And I feel bad. Just save your money and go to thrift stores. Thank you again, Sugar Boutique, for even giving me a new bundle in the first place because I was definitely going to get a refund and she just decided to give me a new bundle instead. So I appreciate it. All right, guys, that is it for me today. I want to say thank you so much for coming to my channel and even subscribing. I cannot believe we have 1,000 subscribers already, and it's completely growing in every aspect. Like, I'm almost at 1.4K, and that's crazy. So I just want to say thank you. Um, make sure you guys continue to subscribe, like, comment, and if you guys are a fan of my videos, make sure you hit that bell button. So thank you guys so much for coming and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.